a caffeine bracelet could be changing the way like you get your energy during the day. Rather than going to get a cup of coffee at Starbucks, you could just put on a bracelet and it transmits the caffeine directly through your skin. So mm. the way this works is caffeine is one of the only fat and water soluble elements then can be put inside the bracelet directly and then it goes straight into your bloodstream essentially. It's like a, like a nicotine patch. Yeah, that's exactly the same way it would work. Except okay. for this one, they're branding it as a bracelet. I think it's because the nicotine patch kind of has a weird <laughs> connotation. The bracelet seems so much nice. It's like a fitness bracelet. No, it's like it's the, caffeine. the first thing I thought of was, do you remember those balance bands that were oh, yeah. I was, such a rip-off? I rip -off? was totally scammed by that. Really? I had one of those. No, yep. I remember I that tripped. they would I would watch people doing it in the mall and the I would where you're like yeah and I'm like yeah your body just gets used to it after the second time you're ready for him to press on your arm why didn't I invent that I don't know but so this thing isn't supposed to be a scam but who knows honestly at this point but it's not gonna be you put it on and then all of a sudden you have a burst of energy rather than just drinking a cup of coffee and having the caffeine hit you all at once, you'll put on the bracelet, and over a four-hour period of time, it will be slowly, uh, it would transmit into your skin, essentially. So, here's my first question. So, this is a single-use bracelet, right? This is not something that you just put on, and it's like a month's worth of caffeine. Yeah, I think it could go into a situation where they could have refillable little packets, but right now, it is a single-use bracelet. Okay. Problem number one I have, why this is never going to work, I think it's too dangerous, okay? When you start having bracelets that can transmit drugs into people, I think you have to start worrying about like what happens if a small child gets a hold of one of these bracelets, especially if you've got like the quad espresso version of the bracelet <laughs> and your kid has some kind of caffeine overdose. Uh, I think it could be problematic. Now, with that being said, I'm not really interested in this. I think one of the reasons, at least for me, like when I drink coffee, um, I'm not drinking coffee all day. Right, I yeah. find that like I enjoy coffee when I really need it. Right, like yeah. if I'm really tired and it's like good, let me get a cup of coffee. Um, I'm not one of those people that needs to just like hit the first cup right when you wake up and then just maintain throughout the entire day. Yeah, I mean maybe for those people this could be a great product, but personally, uh, I don't know if I don't know if I'm interested. I don't know. I feel like for that reason, I kind of like the idea of it. And I think that the point of you making about the children, I think that kind of defeats the purpose of it. There are lots of things that children shouldn't have their hands on, but they have their hands on them anyways. That's true. I know when I was little, I actually got my hands on a small bead bracelet that was supposed to be childproof because it was made for children, but I ended up swallowing it. My mom had to pick <laughs> me up by my ankles and like That's shake it out of funny. my body. Yeah, but I, I'm, I'm a survivor, so... I but, put a, a matchbox car wheel up my nose. Oh, that's a weird when time. I was a kid. How do you explain that? You're like, ah, oh, yeah, it's in You're there. a kid, you know? It's like, <laughs> I, is this going to go in here? Yep. Now it's in here. <laughs> yep, now it's there forever. I mean, yeah. I mean, that's not even bad. I feel like all everyone has a good yeah, story like that. Yeah, and they always get weirder. Like, I feel like you tell, like, the most like normal version of the story but it always has like a weird turn where it gets like oh did you really do that are you that kind of person <laughs> and you're totally right all right so let me know what you think about the caffeine bracelet in yeah. the comments below don't forget to subscribe